everybody. Welcome to another episode of Tech It. Um, hopefully my audio is working today. Uh, if you remember, well you probably, if you even watched the last video because the audio was botched up, uh, we made a quarry and it's going along swimmingly. Got some of these golden pipes which if you put a redstone torch next to it, it'll uh, speed things along the pipes but uh, there it is, it's going and I've got a few steam engines powering it um, I had I went down and got some lava but I think I may have to get some more um, eventually I'll go down and do that now be right back. Okay, and I went and got a couple extras. Because if you put lava buckets in these steam engines, they'll run more efficiently and they use the lava. The lava lasts longer. Oh. There we go. Uh, so today I thought we would make a energy condenser. So it'll help us with our materials a bit. And I think we have enough diamonds to spare, because we can make more once we make the condenser. Um, let's see, we'll need the high-end conveyance dust, which we need a diamond and coal, which we have plenty of the coal. Well, maybe not as much as I thought. Let's see, coal and diamond. And we should still have the other two, yep. Now, to make the condenser, we need four diamonds, four obsidian. Oh, I gotta get some obsidian, which will be easy. I have the diamond pick in an alchemical chest, which we need iron, diamond, covalent dust, chest, and stone. So. stone. These chests are a bit unorganized at the moment. That's only because I needed some to dump it in the quarry. So, green, blue, blue, diamond, iron, And I gotta cook this stone up real quick. I'm gonna make an electrical furnace too. So that I can stop using this coal. So at the moment that solar those solar panels are only powering the mass rater. Uh, stone. Have an alchemical chest. Now, alchemical chests are kind of cool because they're much bigger. And if you put a talisman of repair in here, it'll repair all of your stuff. But for the moment, we're just going to use it for the um, condenser. Now, a quick way to make some lava into obsidian is to pour some water on it. But there should be some water around here. I think I see some on my mini map. Yep. Got a few buckets worth. Do I have my diamond pick on me? Yes, I do. Once we get enough diamonds, I can maybe make some diamond armor and eventually get into the high-end armors. But for now, we'll go back down into our mine. Okay. Now, let's see if I can remember... Oh. Ow. That sucked. 
see if I can remember where I saw some lava. I think it was around here. There's already some. Get some cobblestone to block up this water. So we don't accidentally fall into the lava, which I'm gonna turn into obsidian there. Of course I didn't bring any torches with me, that would be silly. <sighs> Alright, well I'm going to skip this boring part of mining obsidian because as you can see it takes forever. Okay, last piece. I got all of it because I'm also going to need it for another portal. So we'll go back up. How many did I get? 28. It'll be more than enough. Apparently my home ladder is here somewhere. So it says this wave point. There it is. Let's see if I can't run upstairs and just avoid the skeleton altogether. Wait a second. Okay. still going. Okay, I'll take this up. Now, you need this in the middle, that, and that. Like an energy condenser. Now, I'll pop these back in here. So we're going to need room. do is plunk that down there and we can put what we want to make say diamonds here okay once it gets the EMC up to 8192 it'll make a diamond so I need to see about doing is making some diamond transport pipe so that way I can filter out and put all the cobble in there. Also 
make it daytime. So yellow, we'll put dirt and wood. Cobblestone. Uh, and everything else should go in the other chest, maybe. Power's going down already. Now this is also where uranium, the uranium I mentioned, comes in handy. So I believe it takes two uranium to make a diamond. Uh, so we have four. If we plunk it in there. Get two diamonds. Throw a bucket in there. Throw this cobble in there. Throw this wood. Not the tin. All this dirt. This will make a lot of. Yeah, see? This is where we can chuck all of our garbage. diamonds or whatever we want it to really as long as it has an EMC value we can use it and the reason why I saved this is the rest of the subsidian is for the, the nether So we can chuck this tungsten in there. All this dirt, cobblestone. Not the wooden planks, we'll keep those. Seeds. I'll get checked in there. What else have I been saving? diamonds. Now alternatively we could oh, throw me diamond on the floor. We could use that and make 
some emeralds. For some more tools. Also throw some iron in there. This iron's fairly cheap. See, one diamond makes 33 of it. So. But you could also just repair your stuff. At least I think I don't really know how the conveyance dust works. I'll have to research that um, for next time. But. We'll, uh, make some more iron. Could I? Oh, buckets. Leave one to condense. Set it back making diamonds. We'll make some iron armor. Actually, it's more protective than gold. Yeah. So, I think that is where I will end things today. We've made ourselves an energy condenser. Maybe next time we'll see about making an energy collector, but for that we need a lot more diamonds and we'll need to go out to the nether. Um, yeah, and once we make that then we can make it out of pretty much the air. <laughs> so, uh, until next time, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like, subscribe, thumbs up, whatever you need to do, um, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.